coming up. The main event, Vito Sanchez, Walter Santibanez. Right around there, they agree to wait at 124 for this. The judges are ready. The fighters are ready. The world is ready. Indio, make some noise if you are ready! His opponent fighting at the red corner. Wearing blue trunks trimmed in white, he weighed officially 124 and three quarter pounds. In 11 bounds as a young professional, he stands perfect in the ring. 11 victories, no defeats, seven big wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, the fighting son of Cathedral City, California, the undefeated Jose Tito Sanchez. Tito Sanchez, 11 and 0, seven KOs. Dave, when you're a young fighter, and you got the veteran like Santibanez, because they're both in southpaw stance, what do you want to see from Tito? You know, with Tito right here, he's just filling them out right now. And Tito says he switches from southpaw to orthodox. So right now he's coming off on a southpaw stance to see if he sticks to it. And he's naturally left-handed. He writes with his left hand, but he'll... Go to Orthodox, he said, with no problem. He, that's just how he fights. He likes that. Santibanez had a big victory over Manny Flores in June. And Sanchez was in the building for that. Watch it. Scheduled for 10 rounds. Sanchez and Walter Santibanez. Nice body shot by Tito. Shot from Santi Baez. Santi Baez is the, has the quicker hands, but you can hear who's the bigger puncher. That's Tito. When Tito throws his oh, shot, uh, Santi Baez had a couple. <laughs> well, two shut up at the game. Well, you know, I think Santi Baez got some snap in his punches, but Tito got some thud in his punches. You can hear that. It was an Alberto Mercado, you knew from the wild card, all Puerto Rican. Ooh, nice combination by Santi Baez. This is what Santi Banez wants to do. Flores and make you uncomfortable. He did that to Betty Flores, who was never able to figure it out. How will Sanchez do? Santi Banez is being more active with the combinations, but Tito's landing some, some vicious body shots that's gonna take a toll as the rounds go on. That, that body shot, like yeah. that one upstairs? It's, money, it's putting money in the bank. Nice body shot. Santi Ranez, puts together combinations. Somebody's bleeding. Uppercut from Santi Ranez. Uppercut ah, from Tito. Big uppercut by Tito. Body shot from Tito. Oh, Santi Ranez. And, and he could, moved it back. And you could tell that Santi Baez is feeling Tito's power. Yes, he is. Because he's not so elusive. He's tightening up on his defense. He's been. He's tightening up because he knows he has to brace for the shots. And like that one, more body work from Tito. Uppercut from oh. Tito. And that shot buckles Sandy Baez. And look, Sandy Baez is throwing combinations, but there's nothing on those shots. He's lost the steam, and it's all Tito Sanchez here in the second round. Yeah. Heck of a round for Tito Sanchez. And Santi Juanes throws a couple back his own. Oh, oh here. big overhand. Oh. What are they saying in the corner of Tito Sanchez, Brandy Flores? Well, they're telling him to keep attacking the body. That's where they're hurting Santibanez really badly. And to just keep his head moving back and forth and to not get caught because Santibanez, as you can see, can counter. And he's going right back to work. Now he's fighting off the orthodox stance. Now it's Santibanez going to the body and going upstairs. Nice double hook to the body. Oh, and he goodness. runs right back to the liver. And Sandy Baez are filling these shots, man. It's slowing them down. You can see it. And you know, those shots, you know, Sandy Baez is the older fighter. Those body shots are going to slow your legs down. Maybe he's not able to move. Good overhand. Oh, Santi Baez. That was a good shot by him off his, his shots. He's letting his hands go, but there's nothing on it. That was a good shot right there. Let's find out what Cole. Coach Joel Diaz has to say, he's with Brandy Flores right now. 
Joel, you were saying something in the corner about his right hand. What's going on with uh, Theodore? Right All right, so a tight wrap that's what he's complaining about. On the right hand, what does that feel like? You know, me personally, I never liked the wraps being too tight. Okay. We're seeing that here, body shot. Moves back, watch him. Nice combination by Tito. Oh, and he hurts Sandy Baez yes, with that left, did. with that right hook to the body chin. He hurt him. Sanchez. Sandy Baez is hurt. Yes, he is. He slowed down a lot. Tito Sanchez. Looking good in the main event. Now I see what Miguel Cotto saw when he signed him. This That's is the a top three. Great, great right uppercut that Tito sets up. Another strong round. Tito Sanchez, Walter Santibanez going at it in Indio, California to close out the year. Let's go. Big shot. Let them know right now, this is a fun fight between Tito Sanchez and Walter Santillanes. Make sure you share the Golden Boy social media links and let people know it. Forget the football game, that game sucked. Right now, this is a heck of a fight right now. So we'll keep doing what you're doing, you're winning the fight. And now Santillanes is moving away from Tito. He's no longer in the middle of the ring. Look at Tito, that's a confident young man right now. Yeah, you know, standing by, he's stubborn. He's gonna keep trying. Nice hard shot. In the fourth round, Sanchez threw almost 150 punches. Wow. And at the end of that round, he stared at Santibani and showed some emotion. Good body shot. Switching stances in the middle, throwing punches. The body shots by Tito have changed Sandy Baez's game. Yeah, he's not he's not committing to the punches. Tito's doing damage right there. No, no, Santi Baez is a solid one. What are they saying, Brandy? For the second. Right hand from Tito. The punches thrown in five rounds. It is Tito Sanchez making the guys at Coffee Box work tonight. That's what he was talking about, about the fast stuff he went through. And right there in between, Sandy Baez lands a big shot. Don't do that. You can't. And put on this kind of performance that says a lot about the kind of fighter that Sanchez is. Against a very, very tough Walter Santi Baez. Oh, oh man. man. Tito. Santi Baez Baez counters. Is stubborn. He's a stubborn man. He takes big, big shots. Tito's, Tito's hitting him with everything. Body shots are moving, Sandy Baez. He's trying to keep the elbows tight. But he's hurt. He's hurt bad, and Tito just has to stick to it. And then Santi Wine just counters like that. That's why he's still dangerous. And that takes... He still just keeps the hands on, huh? Doesn't care if Santi Wine is landing. Oh, Santi Wine. Yeah, Sensi Sandy Bynes, yep. And he's tapping that eye away. You know, Tito's eye is slow. And he keeps tapping that eye. Right, right there, and taps it up with the guy's trading. This is a fun fight, man. Ooh, that shot right there oh. buckled Sandy Bynes. That shot buckled him. Oh. And Santi Bynes got back. comes right back. Man, this guy's a warrior. He gets buckles and comes right back. He doesn't care. He's gonna go on his shield. But you Finals. know, Tito got him hurt. Double back up. Double right back up. Oh, what a round. Oh, big shot round. by Sandy Baez. We got one more to go. Santi <laughs> Baez so says something to Tito. Tito smiled. Said a couple plus words in Spanish, but out of respect in a funny way. And they're just gonna go at it. You know, it's crazy because the way the fight started, it looked like Tito was on his way to get a knockout because yeah. the body shots were doing so much damage. And then Sandy Baez comes back and gets a second win. Yep. It's, he reminds me of a Gabriel Zotto. <laughs> you guys are built different, man. You think different. He's game, man. He's game. Oh, oh that was oh. a big overhand by Tito. Tito Sanchez. 
His coach told him you can finish him in the last round. Can he? Set up the right shots, and that's what Tito's doing right now. He's going up to the body. He comes right back with an uppercut. It's who picks the smart shots right now is going to get the best out of the round. Sanchez in blue. Oh, oh Sandy Baez. big shot by Sandy Baez. Oh, oh he's Tito so comes well. back with a big straight line. Warriors. Oh, oh, oh. Sandy Baez rocked Tito right uh, there. Wild Heart Warriors. These two go back and forth from the opening bell. They went out of 10 seconds to go. We'll be quiet. What a fight. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after 10 exciting rounds of boxing, we go to the scorecards. One more time, fight fans, for the relentless war between the ropes. Put your hands together for these two professional boxers. And here are the scoring totals. Both Pat Russell and Fernando Villarreal score at 99-91. Zach Young has it 98-92. All for your winner by unanimous decision. And still undefeated from Cathedral City, Jose Tito Sanchez. The hug for the grandfather introducing the boxing. Respect the dance between the two. Tito Sanchez now 12 and 0.